This is code.org. Harvesting with conditionals. The challenges. Let's get going. And bonuses. Bonus level. Let's go. All right. So I have one block in my workspace. I need 10. The pumpkins mark the place where you should turn right. Otherwise, keep going forward. But remember to collect all the lettuce of corn along the way. Okay, so this is a bit different. Now, I should only use one move forward, which tells me I need a heck of a lot of repeats. So you... Ooh, what's the... There's some stuff we haven't used a lot. Let's see. That's one, two, three, four, five away. Hmm. Wall path ahead. If the pumpkins tell us where to turn, well, then as long as there is a pumpkin, I should probably keep going. While there is... Oh, no, because we have to grab them. Okay. While there's path ahead, right? Because we don't know how long it will be. What do I want to do? Well, hmm. I need to get this, and I know this is corn, because I know. <laughs> if there is lettuce, nope. If there is corn, what should we do? I think we're going to pick it, right? And then what? Let's go ahead. Maybe I can. So I know there's no corn on this first one, so I'm going to move forward. If there's corn, I'm going to pick the corn. Then I'll keep moving forward. And now I should stop when I get to this pumpkin. Oh, so it sees the pumpkin and says there's still path ahead of me. Oh, OK, well, that's fine. Because if there is a pumpkin, what should I do? Well, I should pick the pumpkin, but I know I'm going to turn. So if this is true, if there's a pumpkin, do pick it, but then turn right. Nope. Yes. So this is a conditional. This loop is as long as this is running, as long as there's path ahead. So while there is path ahead, move forward. Okay, so I'll check. And you see the little radar go out, right? Here, little radar, yep, there's path ahead of me, and what am I going to do? I'm going to step, I'll move forward, then if there's corn, is there any corn here? False. This is false, so I don't pick. And then what? If there's pumpkins, no pumpkins, so it ignores that. Uh, I should radar out. Is there path ahead? Yep. If there, I'll move forward. If there's corn, oh, I should check for lettuce, too, because apparently they're mean, and they'll randomly do that as well. Pick that. All right, let's see how far this gets us. And then it's just going to keep repeating. So let's go through this. This is looking good. So what do I do? I hit step. And I check. Is there a path there me? There is. So then I move forward. Then what do I do? I check if there's corn. This is false. There's not currently corn there. So then what do I do? I check if there's lettuce. This is false. And if this is false, right, the computer says, nope, not true. It doesn't try to pick the lettuce because there would be an error. There's no lettuce there. Now I check, is there a pumpkin? Nope, no pumpkin here. So that's all good. I hit the bottom, and now I'm going to see if there's a radar. Boop. Is there still path ed? Yes. So this is true. There's still path ed. I must move forward. Then what? Same deal. Computer's going to hit this if. If there's corn. Well, I'm standing on it, so this is true. You're going to see me pick the corn. Now what? Okay, if there's lettuce. That's false. No lettuce. This won't highlight. Is there a pumpkin? Nope, that's false. Back around. You saw the radar? Boom, boom. Is there corn? That's false. I won't pick the corn. Is there lettuce? That's going to be true. So you'll see me pick. Now, boop. Is there a pumpkin? Nope. Radar, yep. So I have to keep moving. Move forward. Is there corn? False. Lettuce, false. Pumpkin, false. Radar, yep. There's a path here. Step forward. Okay. Corn's false. Lettuce is false. Is there a pumpkin? This is now true. The computer will say true. So you'll see I have to pick this pumpkin. Then what do I do? Turn right. Now, turning right means there's even more path. Hit Yep, still path, and let's see. Victory! Onward. All right, and let's do this bonus. All right. Oh my goodness, look at this. So I think they want us to get all the veggies. I'm going to use a similar pattern. So turn right at the pumpkins. Cool. So we know how to do this. Hopefully you just checked out what we just did. Otherwise, it's going to be super confusing. So as long as there's path ahead, I'm going to say move forward. And notice I only use it once. We should not use more than 14 blocks. As long as there's path ahead, I'm going to move forward. If there is, I'll start with corn. Then I'm going to do if there's lettuce. Then I'm going to do if there's a pumpkin. Now, just like we did before, if you're confused, you need to go back a few minutes and watch this other section. So if there's corn, I'm going to pick the corn. If there is lettuce, I'm going to pick the lettuce. 
Now what? Well, if there's pumpkins, I also need to pick the pumpkin, but it tells us right here that we need to turn left. So turn, uh, turn right at pumpkins. Boom. All right, let's step through this and see if this is going to do it. Step. You see my radar shoot out. So there is path ahead. This is true. So everything in this pink mouth thing must run. I must move forward. Now, is there corn? No, I'm not currently standing on corn. That's false, so I won't pick it. Is there lettuce? Nope, this is also false, not standing on it. Pumpkins? Nope, not standing on it. Hit back, you saw the radar. Step forward. Is there corn? This is true, so guess what? Goodbye, pick the corn. Is there lettuce? Nope, corn, nope. Shoot the radar, move forward. Now what? Well, now I am on nothing, so I'll pick nothing. All that's false. Move forward. Now, move forward. Is there corn? False. Is there lettuce? Pick the lettuce. Ah, notice this little key thing? I should be turning left, but I don't. So I'm about to hit the wall. That's a fun little switcheroo. So let's pick the lettuce, and then every time we're at a lettuce, let's turn left. Let's see if that gets us all the way around. This is looking good, just like before. And remember, the only time the stuff in an if statement can run is if that is true. Oh, no. uh-oh, we're leaving stuff on the board. Ooh, they're making this even more difficult. So as long as there is corn, so instead of if there's corn this time, let's say as long as there is corn, right? We're going to pick it. So instead of if, if we'll only do this once, a while, as long as there's this is true, it's going to do the task. So it works like an if statement, except it repeats. We're in a repeat, just like while there's path ahead, this repeats. Well, while there's corn. So I'm going to check each time, just like an if would. Hey, is there corn? If so, do this. But it hits the bottom and it goes and checks again. If only checks once and then we keep going. While will check more than once. And as long as it is true, right? Whereas an if says if there's corn, it will pick the corn and then it moves on. No, let me show you. A wall loop, right? When I get to this corn, second, there we are. It says, oh, yep, that's true. So I pick, Choop, and you're going to see it. Boom. Now it has to run this again. I have to check again. Whereas an if would keep going, I have to check again. That's true. So I pick it. Now it has to run it again. It is true. So I pick the last corn. Now it has to run wall again. It is false. So I won't pick the corn and I'll drop beneath. I'll just give this a shot. And that's happening because there could be multiple of our veggies. Oh, I need to flip that over the lettuce. They're making us work for this. Oh, what happened there? There's only ever one pumpkin. So if I check for pumpkins multiple times, and is there only... Ah, there's only one lettuce. So if there's only one of these, we don't need wall loops. They are making our lives hard, guys. So if there's only ever one lettuce, there's only ever one pumpkin, because otherwise we would turn around because it's always going to check twice, right? So a wall loop is always going to check at least twice, and it might get us to turn around. Oh, wait a minute. There's going to be multiples. They are not nice. So what I'm going to do to make sure we pick them I'm going to use both here. Because it looks like there could be multiples, but there also might not be. So while there's lettuce, I'll pick it. While there's a pumpkin, I'll pick it. However, I'm going to have a separate if here. Before I pick the lettuce, I'm going to say if there's lettuce, I'm going to want to turn left. And then right before if there's a pumpkin, or while there's a pumpkin, because that will let me pick multiple pumpkins. But before I pick them all, I'm going to say, if there are pumpkins, turn right. Then pick them all. That a shot. Did we do it? Holy smokes, that was tough. Onward.